guys, how's it going? Skylar here, and today I wanted to do things a little bit differently and talk about an app I recently found and, and, and enjoy using called Cheddar. And before I end up talking about this app, I would really like to know if you guys have any apps that you use and any all-in-one apps or, you know, specific apps that do just specific things. I, I have a few apps that I use that do specific things. I don't, I haven't found an all-in-one app. At any rate, if you guys have found anything you like, put it down in the comments. I'd love to know. Uh, also, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. I'd love to do more videos like this. I just don't know if it's if it would be well received or not. Maybe I'll do a video of all my apps that I use that I, I find to be my favorite. Uh, at any rate, um, let's get let's get into it. So, <clears throat> first of all, uh, I split this up so you, you should see the. Uh, I was uh, doing this recording on my iPad and my uh, uh, Note 8. So the left is the iPad, the right is the Note. Um, so you can kind of see what it looks like with Android and Apple. But if you look at the, the layout up top, you have all the coins that you're currently watching and you can hop into each coin and, and check out information in it. Will, um, but uh, the middle um, just shows all kinds of information on coins. The um, bottom shows all kinds of information on services. And then you have your, you know, quick links and basics. Um, you know, uh, profile stuff on, on the very bottom and, and other stuff. So if we go into one of the coins up at the watch list, uh, Metablock, we can see up here that we have, uh, you know, basic information on the coin. We have graph charts, we have, you know, reviews, other coins that, you know, maybe like it. You can, uh, you know, see how many people are watching it, uh, services they have. You can, uh, you know, add your Metablock address in there. You can go more into the About Me, see a little bit more in depth, how many coins they have, how many are on the circulating supply, when they started, what kind of token they are, uh, or coin they are. Uh, you can even go into uh, and compare other coins to this. So uh, if we compare it to a medical chain, uh, you can kind of see, you know, what similar coins are like side by side. The left is a tablet. That's why it has a video. But uh, you you can see you know kind of a, everything that it would be in the about section you'll see on here but you'll see it uh, you know side by side so you can compare the coins before you end up doing that uh, in-depth analysis on it on it so if we go back to the home page we'll see uh, the coin section if we hit the rankings uh, then we'll be able to see what we see if we type coinmarketcap.com uh, they just bring those rankings over uh, on uh, onto this uh, they also let you have let you uh, categorize the 24-hour low highs as well as the 24-hour lows as well for the day. Uh, and then something that a lot of a lot of apps don't do is is talk about ICOs. And this app allows you to uh, add an ICO that's going on, uh, put information on it, um, and then uh, people can rate it and review it and. Uh, and check it out uh, and then these are all the upcoming ICOs that people have put in and there's there's thousands of them so we know that we're missing some but uh, and then if you go to the bottom right all coins um, on the coin section it's just this just is ICOs coins 24-hour highs lows it's just everything just not uh, filtered whatsoever now the bottom section is services so it shows current current wallets so that uh, you can download and, and reviews and rates that people have done for it. Um, and again, like uh, the nice thing about the thing I love about this app is if you don't, if it's not on here, you can add it yourself and then you can, uh, uh, and then once they approve it, you know, then, uh, then other people can rate and review it. But, um, this right here is all the, <coughs> um, current exchanges they have on it. And then if you go to the all services, it shows, uh, all the wallets and the exchanges that the the app currently offers on the bottom section we have a uh, you know home that's obviously what takes us to that page uh, search just searches for everything so uh, exchanges and wallets ICOs coins anything you can go to your profile uh, this is where you can you know add your own coin wallet it shows um, all your reviews that you've done how many people are following you um, and the nice thing is that coin wallet is you can add any coin that they have and people can donate to you which is nice but um, activity shows all the activity that's going on uh, on the site currently 
uh, any review that's gone on, any any wall that's been added, anything. And then the more is just kind of a lot of the links that we have seen already, just kind of bundled into one. You can add your coins here. You can add services here. Uh, change your profile. Learn the basics is cool. Um, uh, it kind of shows you a basic information about cryptocurrency if you've never heard about it before or, or are very novice. But one thing I would like to see on this app is I. I would like to see chat rooms. I, I'd like to see them in, in in the individual coins, or maybe a main chat room, uh, some way where, where we can communicate with other people. Uh, I find that you know my best, my favorite conversations are random people I, I meet in, in chat rooms. Like you know, like we're living in the '90s again. It's, it's crazy, but uh, I would like to see that uh, portfolio. I would love to be able to see where my coins are at, how much money I'm making, uh, without having to go to a separate app for that or having to check my, you know, my wallet. Um, and then this isn't a big one, but I, I would like to see a crypto calculator converter. Uh, I end up needing that a lot. Uh, and um, something no app has is a uh, exchange calculator. Uh, I'd love to be able to um, you know, know what all those little fees are and what they add up as well um, before I end up doing it and before I have to go to the site and actually do it as well. So, I mean, a couple things, not really a big deal, but um, but what they do have is awesome. Um, and I love the idea of people being able to review the apps themselves and, and the app, the, uh, sorry, review the coins themselves and, uh, and be able to, you know, take a part of the coins you know, ranking and be able to read, you know, read other people's comments and reviews, be able to post videos and, you know, I, I don't know, I, I love the interaction for sure. Um, not a lot of other apps have that. <clears throat> oh, another uh, section is, is news. Um, I would love if they had um, a, a news section um, on the app as well. And a lot of apps do have news sections, but they're not current. And they'll even say, like, posted an hour ago, and I'm like, well, I read that yesterday, or, you know, that actually came out early this morning, or something like that. But, uh, at any rate, um, if you guys uh, have any apps that you currently use, I'd love to know what they are uh, for cryptocurrency. Put it in the comment section below. <coughs> um, I'll download them, check them out, do a video. In fact, I'm going to do a video of... Uh, of all the uh, apps that I use actually coming up um, next week probably but uh, but yeah uh, I really appreciate you guys if this if you like this video pl please leave a like up if, uh, thumbs up uh, if, if you want to see more like it um, also uh, if you want to see more videos like this I do post uh, at least once a week if not multiple times a week about cryptocurrency related information so <clears throat> if you want to subscribe um, to get more that would be cool but uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys and have yourself a wonderful day. Take care, bye.